Today we're going to talk about saving time by using shortcuts in the BigQuery console window. First one we're going to talk about is running the entire query. So we're going to use command enter on Mac or control enter on Windows. So there it is. Uh, if we want to just run part of the query, uh, we can highlight it here and we'll hit command E on the Mac or control E on Windows. Now, this one is going to be familiar for people who use Sublime Text. So let's say that we want to comment out part of the query. So I'm going to highlight what we have here, and I'm going to hit Command forward slash on Mac or Control forward slash on Windows. If I want to uh, uncomment out, it's going to be the exact same thing. So Command forward slash on Mac or Control forward slash on Windows. The last one I'm going to talk about is also going to be familiar to people who use uh, Sublime Text or Visual Studio Code, and that is multiple cursors. So why would you want to do that? So let's look at this uh, kind of query here, and you can see that we have three instances of this rating column. So, and let's say that we want to change this. Let's look at the columns that we have here. And let's say that we want to change this to num votes. So I'm going to position the cursor after one of the instances of that column. So we'll put it here and I'm going to hit uh, command option on the Mac. I'm going to hold that down and you can also use uh, control alt on Windows and I'm going to click uh, right here and right here. And you can see that now I have a cursor for each one of those instances and I'm going to hit backspace and num votes. So now you can see uh, it kind of works like a find and replace. I've got, uh, got those replaced. So I hope that helps and you can see we've got uh, all these summarized here. Uh, and if you're interested, please subscribe for more information on Data Studio, Google Analytics, and Google Tag Manager.